contest is a tables match. Making his way to the ring from London, England, weighing in at 238 pounds, the Undisputed Byron, do you think the motivation is an issue for the champ seeing as the title is not on the line in this one? Not at all, Michael. In fact, given that the title is not up for grabs, I suspect the champ is more motivated to try new things here. As a reminder, guys, this one-on-one -on -one contest will be a tables match, which is great, just as long as these two know not to use our table. There are plenty of other tables they can choose from here. You can feel the electricity running through this arena. This is going to be some battle, one-on-one, -on -one, mano a mano. And this is one of those matches where it's hard to believe we get paid for this. Well, actually, oh, hard to believe Saxton gets paid for anything. He's got to do something to get back in this thing. Boom! <laughs> I don't believe it. And that table can shorten careers, Michael. He wants no part of the outside. It shouldn't be a shock that the Dudley boys were involved in one of the most intense tables matches we've seen in recent memory. At the 2015 TLC event, the Dudleys called on their extreme brothers Tommy Dreamer and Rhino to battle the Wyatt family in an eight-man elimination tables match. People were flying everywhere that night. And in classic ECW fashion, so were the trash cans and kendo sticks. The match of 2015's TLC event with the Dudleys, Tommy Dreamer and Rhino versus the Wyatts, was chaos from the second all eight superstars were in the ring. Ron Strummel was awesome in his destruction of all four members of Team Extreme, but the ECW originals kept their focus on making table in play. Up and... Oh my god, so much damage inflicted. He's docking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Incoming. Harsh impact. Oh boy, he is rolling. Irish whip. He looks a bit off his game here. I fully expect him to bounce back, though. This is the type of one-on-one -on -one atmosphere where he thrives. He's starting to look a little uneasy to meet Cole, and I can't say that I blame him. 
He's one wrong move from being put through a table. Irish whip. Oh, right to the chest. Leg drop. He's looking a little off balance. Guys, he's going to have to turn things around quickly if he wants to win this thing. You can learn a lot about a guy in a match like this. And what I've learned so far here tonight is that there is absolutely no quit in him. Nailed it. Beautiful technique. He's on the defensive now. He'll need to find a way to turn things around here. He's taking on some damage. Ah! Bomb! Nobody does it quite like him. Gets out of the way of that one. Drop kick! Oh, oh great height. Boom! <laughs> Oh boy, he is rolling. Talk about having the living hell beat out of you. Looks to me like he just hit a wall. Clearly they're both running on fumes right now. And at this point, it might just be a matter of which superstar's tank reaches empty first. They get dangerous out here, especially when there are no countouts. They get dangerous out here, especially when there are no countouts. He's close to being done here. A slingshot neck breaker. Nice. That should do it. Melee, pandemonium. Oh, nasty impact. Uh oh. Oh, through the table. This table match and its carnage is over. I can't believe what we just saw. Tables matches are fan favorites for a reason, folks. Remember this? Yeah, he's putting in the work. Highlight for one superstar, low light for another. And here's the last piece of the puzzle. That's a big win, and to be honest, it looked like this tables match could have gone either way there for a while. That's the kind of win that makes you feel good about yourself. It'll be interesting to see the fallout following this big singles win here tonight.